Hi everybody, I'm Jim Shore. Welcome to my house in South Carolina. Here we're in the kitchen. Uh, there's a couple things I want to uh, show you. Recent projects. They're actually uh, a way for us to utilize all of my uh, artwork that we generate. Can generally, it starts out work doing artwork for our figural pieces that we make, which we're probably most well known for. But we have a, an accumulation of thousands of pieces of artwork as a result. And uh, we thought it'd be a good idea to try to utilize them to their uh, full potential. And we thought, okay, they start out as line drawings, okay? And we think, okay, what can you do with a line drawing? Well, uh, recently, um, I guess, uh, adult coloring books have become, well, you know, fairly popular. And uh, coloring books, of course, have always been popular with kids. And we've got, so we put together something that I think will appeal to adults and kids alike. And uh, they're <clears throat> coloring books. Now this one here has been around for, this is my first one, it's been around for just a little while. And it is, uh, of course, taken from a painting that I made while on, as a, a demonstration of my art uh, at a trade show in, uh, up in Pennsylvania uh, some years ago. And we've, we've used this, uh, this image from time to time. This is from a painting called Awaken the Day. And uh, so that's artwork. And then this is patterning and so forth that we've used in, uh, on different art projects when we put it together for this cover. Now, <clears throat> the thing about it is we have gone a little bit farther than the average coloring book in that we have uh, demonstrated the, the, our, our coloration of the, the uh, end result as we've colored it with, and that is examples of the pieces that you'll see in the book, which are presented like this, okay? These kind of things. Now they're not, they're not highly complex, and I think that's a good idea because uh, it keeps you from, it keeps your interest peaked, and it's something that in a very short period of time you can actually have a piece of artwork that'll look as good as some of these things, and it's you know suitable for framing or, or you know whatever you can set, give them as gifts and that kind of stuff. And people like things that you make yourself. So th this is a good project. It's the Each page is perforated like this, so you can actually easily remove it after, after it's uh, done and do with it what you will. And we've got a little bit of something in here about uh, the artist himself, and that would be me. And also we've got some instructional things in here about, well, a little bit of info about... Uh, what we do and why we do it and how we do it and so forth. Then we've got some instructional things here to sort of help you along. If you're not an experienced, uh, you know, colorist or artist, we've got, uh, got some tips on here about, uh, you know, what you can do to make your, uh, your art a little bit extra special. We've got some ideas on shaping, shading, uh, highlighting, um, color over color, and a lot of different things like that that'll make this thing a little bit more challenging and a lot more fun. Now, okay, that's the uh, that's the first one. Now this now we've just recently come out with this one. This is our latest one, and that's um, as you can see, Faith and Harmony, a coloring book. This here is also a a painting that I did that uh, we used as I think calendar art or something, and it's one of the finished uh, you know finished pieces. Once again, we've got bordering and so forth, and it is a similar format to the other one. We've got the you know, uh, examples of the finished pieces as well as, let's see, full size ones in here somewhere. Full examples of, uh, of what these things can look like if you take your time and you really, uh, you know, uh, use the, and you, frankly, these are just, for your inspiration, you don't have to use these colors at all. You can you can use your imagination and make them any color you want to. And this just gives you an idea of how we approached it, and and what it can be as a finished piece of artwork. And and you can do exactly the same thing with this with this uh, this level of detail, this level of coloration, and everything with color saturation and so forth. That'll make a really really beautiful project. And you don't have to worry about being good at drawing or anything, 
because I have taken care of that for you. It's right here. And we got a little something to, you know, to say along with. So I think uh, these are projects I think you'll, you'll enjoy and love. Uh, it was a delight for us to put it together. And uh, already we've had an awful lot of enthusiastic interest in this. And, uh, and the nice thing about it is that it allows me to share something with you. So that together we can be, uh, we can be artists together. So when these, when these drawings get finished and they get in a frame in your house, uh, you can say it's a collaboration with Jim Shore. So, alrighty. Thanks for spending a little bit of time with me. We've got some other projects we'll show you at some point. And until then, bye-bye.